Hey, all you viewers to be named later. How are we doing today? All right. As you know, going down, you know, getting back into Warhammer 40K and painting stuff and having some fun, um, you got to buy things. All right. And I was in my local gaming store picking uh, paints. You know, these little guys from Citadel that you got to have because they're awesome. Or if you really find the good stuff, Vallejo Game Color, but still. So I saw this, you know, the Space Marines Assault Intercessors paint set. I have been out of it since, like, second version 2 going into version 3. So, I have no idea what an intercessor is. I'm getting the codexes and everything in. But still, I thought, okay, three marines. I thought that these weren't the ultra weenies. That those were just transfers they put on. But no. So, in the box, you're going to get three of them that are unassembled. you got to put them together. Now, what I thought was weird is they're push togethers. Okay? Everything comes on a sprue. You gotta kinda clip it out like you usually do with everything else from Games Workshop, alright? And they kinda only go together one single way. I like the fact that they break it down by number what goes to what. What I thought was a little bit eh, as you can see, the Ultra Weenies chapter badges are molded onto the plastic. So, I now have three different miniatures that I can use for practice on paint schemes and not have to worry about screwing up one of my um, Space Wolves. Now, I did have some problems getting them together, as you can see, like, in there in the mold line. It, right there with that little knee pad, it kind of went a little cockeyed. And I'll admit, I do use Gorilla Glue to put everything together so it holds them in there. So, okay, I got three Marines with bolters, chain swords, and one's got himself a little grenade. But the biggest thing that attracted me to this was you got a Citadel paintbrush, you know, the starter brush, which made me go, wow, it didn't come with a little plastic topper that they usually do to put over the top. And you get six paints. So that basically paid for the box itself. Now, I am filming this on Saturday, June 4th, 2022. Currently, this on Amazon is $29.75. I paid $35 at my local gaming store, but I know you get everything cheaper on Amazon. So, yeah, uh, oh, yeah, $29.75, it's not Prime eligible. So, the six colors you get are McCraggy Blue, which is Ultramarine stuff, Corax White, which is a really basic color, everyone needs white, a bad and black, so you're getting three basic colors, the Astro Granite, which is their technical paint. I know squat about it, but I'm learning. You know? Um, Ag Agrax Earthshade, which to me is kind of like the all-important used to be flesh wash, which was working great for everything from rust to flesh to gold to just everything. And you get Balthazar Gold. So you get really basic colors to get you off and get you running. I thought it was a great purchase. Like I said, my only downside, you know, you get six of these little paint pots in there. Not this one, but six of those colors that size. I thought, cool, I can... You guys who are familiar with my channel, you know exactly what happened, but still. No, they don't come primed. I primed them, and I see some mistakes that I made, so they're gonna have to hit the prime box again, but that's okay. So, we're at the all-important part of the video that I love the most. I wanna know your questions, comments, love, hatred, anger, all that fun stuff right down below. Do you do Warhammer 40K? If you do, what faction do you play? You know, like I said, I, w I got into it second, going into third. I have been a Space Wolf fan, true and true. I will always love the Sons of Russ. Rebuilding a company, I'm enjoying painting a miniature that I already brought to the channel earlier. It's really weird putting paint on a miniature for the first time in two decades. Whew, yeah, I learned a whole bunch of new things. But still, you know, let's get a more discussion going, because I know this is a very popular tabletop war game. I know it's one of the greatest ones ever done, but still... You know, let me know. Have you picked up this set? Would you recommend this set to a beginner? Let's get some conversations on this going. Now, if it made you laugh, made you cringe, made you cry, made you do anything, please hit that big old thumbs up. Only helps the channel out. But there we go, guys. My quick look at the Space Marine Assault Intercessors paint set. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope all of you are having a great day, a safe day. I'll see all of you in our very next video.